So on this episode, we're going to explore whether the DJI Mavic 2 Pro is somewhat waterproof. So here's what happened. About a week ago, I was exploring a waterfall in Costa Rica and I was flying very close to the edge of the waterfall to try and get these shots. And they had these pools in the waterfall that were several meters deep and uh, something happened. I don't know if it was signal interference or maybe my my inability as a pilot but i got too close to the rock side and the drone hit it and then it went under and i felt sick as soon as it happened because i just got this drone recently and it was kind of expensive something like 1500 bucks so um i couldn't swim down there have my contact lenses in i found a local and they rode off in their horse to get some goggles they came back 30 minutes later so the drone's been underwater several meters for 30 minutes they dived down and on their very first attempt, they found the drone in this kind of muddy water. And so the first thing I did is I dried it off on the surfaces. I brought it back to my house and then I stuck it in a big box of rice. So here's the drone dried out. I have no idea if this flies yet. The, the lens itself has some streak marks inside, but a week ago, this had clear moisture on the inside of it. I'll show you some shots. Um, so that's, that's dried out very nicely. Now what I'm gonna do is take off the base and I'm going to clean it with alcohol, just very gently, just to wipe away any salt, if there is salt, and any dirt from the muddy water. So the very first thing I did is I took off the plastic cover on the base and then what I did is I took off very carefully and if you try this in your drone just be incredibly careful but the screws here on this electronic panel are all Phillips okay but the screws on the plastic cover that was on top of this are uh, some other sort they're like this uh, hexagon kind of shape so very carefully I took this off now, you've got to be, I keep stressing this, but you've got to be really careful. See these little things here? Uh, these are plugged in. Okay, so there's one, two, three, four, five, six, six of them. Very gently, we have to lift them up. I don't recommend you put it back in the rice after you've taken these out because if dust gets inside, um, that's not going to be good. So I'm going to clean it very carefully using this. This is to clean screens. Ideally, you should be using alcohol for this, pure alcohol. I couldn't get any, so I'm not going to just spray this onto the electronic board. I'm just going to do it very gently, and I just want to take out any salt, dirt, anything like that. I'm not going to lift this part up because I think if I start doing that, I, I really don't want to damage anything. But we have this part here. This has a fan in it. So I'm gonna be particularly careful with these little plugs because I don't wanna get any dust into these sockets. Okay, so here we are. The drone has been in the rice for a week. I've cleaned it with alcohol very gently. This is not the original battery. The original battery, I put in rice for a week. It's not turning on. So I think the battery is long gone. But I have not tested this yet. I wanted to do it on camera. Either it's gonna work, I'm gonna be happy, or it's not gonna work, and I'm gonna be very annoyed because uh, these are kind of expensive. So I've got the app on. So hopefully when I press this, we're gonna hear a noise telling us that it all works. Okay, here we go. That's looking good. Okay, the engines are moving. The one thing I am a little bit worried about is the fan, if that got any any uh, debris or rice stuck in it. But it sounds, sounds okay. It's still got a tiny little bit of rice left in it. After this, I'm gonna take it apart again and just give it one more clean, but uh, let's see if this flies. Okay, wanna get back just in case it does anything funny. Ready? Take off. 
Oh. That's good. Very good. That's excellent. Okay, it's flying. That's good. That's very good. So I'm I'm genuinely surprised right now. When it crashed, I you know, and I heard it, I heard it go into the water. I just I thought to myself, it's gone. That's the end of it. That's really good. That's good because when you're filming and you're out making these episodes, it just it makes everything more interesting if you have those establishing drone shots. So to be without a drone right now trying to film videos, especially now with the pandemic on, it would be really hard for me to go and buy another one. Um, you know, I don't even know where they sell them here in Costa Rica. So that's great. That's great.